night? What are some of the biggest things you can take away? Uh, probably just, you know, when you're working on a conditioner, a little quick, you know, got out, set the pace, tone, buddy. James look good. Just trying to get a little sharper. Just get used to each other again. And used our sets. Uh, that's the main thing. Then some of the young guys, you know, promising. It looked like, even from the start, there was a sort of determination to run as much as possible. Right. Is that something that you've been emphasizing? Yeah, we talked about it, and I think, that, you know, the biggest thing, James looked like he wanted to do it in the sense he, he sped it up. And Clint, you know, just kind of drove everybody down. And then without, yeah, we had Russ, and he seemed to be quicker, but we got to keep that pace and keep working off that and see if we can improve on it. But, uh, you know, that's, you know, I, you know, I don't have a whole lot to say just because it is what it is. But, you know, we'll see, see what we can do in a couple of days. But definitely the themes will be trying to get out and run more. It might be kind of hard to have intensity in a game like this, but did you feel like they came out with the right kind of attitude? <clears throat> yeah, for sure. Um, it is hard to keep your intensity, but I thought that's probably one of the best jobs we could do. Is it looked like they enjoyed playing with each other, enjoyed running up and down. So, you know, when you do that, then they were never really looking at the score. But uh, they they just not, you know, we keep underlining how important it is to get off good starts and let's go. And, Enjoy yourself at the same time, get a work done, and I thought they did great. How yeah. much of preseason is watching the back end of your roster develop? Uh, a lot, but you know, the back end of our rosters are all veterans, kind of. So it's, uh, you know, the rod we're deep and just trying to get everybody enough runs and stay out there five or six minutes so they can get a good workout. And, uh, you know, we'll, we'll get down to rotation a little bit later as we go on, but uh, uh, you know, it's great seeing the young guys just. Who could maybe help us? You know, pretty excited, especially for them. I'm sure they were on a few stuff. Clemens, Macklemore, yeah. they played really well for you. How would you assess how they did? I thought they did real well. I thought Ben played great. He's a he's a basket. He knows how to play. Um, a lot of good cuts. Athletic as heck. Can shoot it. So there's no reason why he's not an NBA player, and a good one. Uh, so he's got a jam. And then <coughs> Chris, if he's just no, he, he was been good the whole time. Good in summer league, good now. Uh, he's, he, I think he has a chance, real good chance. He makes a score like that, plays that hard, that strong, that quick, that explosive, got a good chance. James didn't make his one legger, but what do you think? Clint about almost him? did, though. He <laughs> got fouled. That's a fair so I think Clint was watching a lot of YouTube this <clears> summer. <throat> uh, I'm going to go out on a limb and say probably more comfortable with James taking that. Think, think yeah, but that man's not real long. <laughs> <laughs> Don't go out there too far. <laughs> yeah, James, you know, he's always trying to put something in his, his game. And, uh, we'll see. But uh, he's so good at the other stuff. I don't even know if he needs it or not. I mean, once he wants to get up 23s or 25, and it's like he's, he, there's, you know, his game's pretty complete, although he keeps trying to get better, which is cool. He called himself a creator <coughs> a couple days ago. Called himself what? A creator a couple days ago. He comes in the uh, do you do you agree with that notion that he's a creator on offense, in terms of the new moves and things oh, like that? Uh, no, he, yeah, for sure. I mean, I'll, um, we'll laugh at it together, but uh, the guy he just keeps trying to prove what what can I do. And the step back is not has historically been an awful shot. He's got it to where he's making a big percentage. Uh, so nothing wouldn't surprise me if he gets that down to where he's just doing it every time, just coming across half court two point legs. I, I don't know, but it wouldn't surprise me. Has he been taking those in these practices? No, not much. Yeah, it was my own throwing in there. But he didn't need to. I mean, he can get the other in the step back. So there's really, I mean, you know, who knows? <laughs> You're going to have to ask him. Anything else? Well, there's a lot of the group here tonight. I appreciate <laughs> <laughs> your participation. See you guys.